we're told that Gill's car uses P litres of petrol per 100 kilometres travelled. Now that means that it's going to be P over 100 litres per kilometre. Because it's P per 100, so I divide by 100, that's going to tell me how much uh, per kilometre. For example, if I have 600 um, litres, I mean this is a ridiculous amount, but 600 per 100 kilometres, then clearly we divide through by 100, it's going to be 6 per 1 kilometre. It's not a bad idea to bring numbers into it if it helps. So that's litres per kilometre. So what if they um, actually go a distance of D? Now let's imagine they go 2 kilometres then it's just going to be twice as much, 12 litres per kilometre. And so for distance d, we're going to have to times through by that distance, p, and then we times just the top by d. You can imagine it being p over 100 times d over 1, but that's going to give pd over 100. So pd litres per d kilometre which is the same as how much we need for a, a journey of distance d. Just got to find it in the answers. There it is.